<laughs> just look how tiny this thing is it's it's like not even my palm size round about 98 grams uh, welcome guys welcome back to the channel opinions matter and if you want to see a size comparison this is my regular 5 inch quad and this is the happy model sailfly uh, x um, Alright guys, so this toothpick quad, uh, when I received it from Pyrodrone, I ordered everything from Pyrodrone, very cheap uh, products, they deliver it very fast and um, support, I mean, who cares about support, you have to fix it yourself anyways, they don't know shit, anybody doesn't know shit. In FPV life, if you are thinking that you'll get a company support, just forget it because it's not going to happen, but guess what happens? Day one, I received this in my package. Uh, my camera out here in the front stops working. Alrighty guys, I was super excited. I uh, bought this Happy Model Selfly X. Uh, I was about to fly today as I can, as you can see, I've clipped all the sides and everything so that all the wiring is protected. But um, binding was super easy. Out of the box, uh, there is something wrong with the camera. So I took off the top canopy and let me show you, let me put a, included battery i think this is the battery that's included and once it's connected you're going to see in my feed i can see everything except the camera now osd is working which means that my esc and the board or the flight controller is working so osd is working it's just the camera that's not working out of the box i posted on facebook uh, when then posted on happy models website Within few uh, minutes, they replied and they said that they are sorry about it and they are going to ship me a new uh, camera, which I was okay. Well, they said it's going to take like few days or so. Within three days, a new camera turns out. And uh, this is what I call support. This camera is actually a little bit hard to find because you will see there are like three pins and then there are other two pins. So it has totally five outputs. So you get the red and the black one, which goes uh, like a positive and negative for this one. And then you have the video and all that stuff uh, going out. So this camera is literally hard to find. They did ship me, guess what? A new camera. How cool is that? Uh, first of all, uh, what I would say, happy model next time, please, please do not include this nylon screws. This nylon screws is a mayhem. But to prevent it from corroding, I have actually, um, if you can watch this properly, I've actually taped this with black tape. I have a black tape running on the sides to save the motors. I have a black tape out here. I have a black tape on this side. Uh, then I did, uh, you know, like uh, do some black tapes, uh, put some black tapes on the side of the quadcopter holding the arms. Uh, now this side also I did put some black tapes again because uh, these nuts keep on falling for some reason uh, I do not want to use Loctite or anything. I will just want to keep it like this How many flights did I had this I had burned? Uh, round about 17 or 18 packs of 2s 3s this is Uncontrollable on 3s 3s this guy flies amazing screams around but these are biblade props, right? So what happens when biblade props try to recover? These biblade props are not able to recover and start shaking and then rolls around. So I would say flips and rolls. Uh, this guy, it might not be the quadcopter that you are thinking to do flips and rolls. 
but I would rather definitely definitely give this guy for racing and other purposes already guys uh, straight up jumping into the footage um, running a 2s out here I think 3s it is super snappy fast but for me I just wanted to go through like small rocks or anything so I selected this small canyon park which uh, we have out here in um, LA uh, totally legal to fry but uh, always do remember they do not fly over people or do not disturb anybody I mean even if you're flying this thing in a park nobody will even complain that's how small it is the second thing is uh, props 65 millimeter props um, I did order pyro drone uh, props because I think they're more stiff I broke a lot of props that day uh, but nothing happened to the frame I think I hit uh, this stone right out there uh, somewhere and the prop broke so this was my second pack again 2s and I'm trying to do a flip out here well you saw the recovery the recovery time was a lot but uh, the drone is snappy fast I should say quadcopter but here for like for of all of us we know this as a drone and um, you know like the whole fun of it and if you guys have not tried flying a quadcopter do go ahead and enjoy flying it's a very unique experience especially if you're doing FPV alrighty guys what do you guys think about this uh, tiny $85 toothpick quad uh, which was originally made by kebab FPV but happy model what an amazing experience uh, with this uh, tiny quad the, from the customer service uh, two flight two tunes uh, you just cannot get wrong for 85 bucks with this now if you want to just because you watch this because I watched a video about uh, Tiny Hawk Emacs and I wanted to enter into FPV just because if you are watching this as a newbie drone or remember this this is not for people those who are just starting out maybe they have a little bit of experience uh, prior to this so but i will highly recommend you this if you want to pick up an fr sky radio you can pick up uh, an fr sky radio this is a Terranis x light and it is running an r9 m light module uh, i do have other quads so i keep all the all the time two antennas connected to this but uh, what an experience so yeah guys if you like this presentation if you thought this review of happy model sailfly x was helpful do give me a thumbs up like and do subscribe to the channel for more updates so take care see you again on another episode